I speak on behalf of Lakshman and myself as well. I think this day, the baby shower, they say usually it's for the mother because she's pregnant and celebrate the mother and everything. But for me, the baby shower is actually to celebrate the baby, to bless the baby. And that's what it really is. Babies, any babies are always a miracle. It's always a gift from God, whether it's planned or not planned. Even if um, it is natural or if you needed a little bit of help with signs and everything, babies, children are God breath. He's the one who breathes life. For us, this baby is just more than a miracle. I think this baby, he already has his own personality. He's already really, really cheeky. He's got his own, you know, style and everything. And the biggest thing is that this baby is a fighter. He's a warrior. Um, this baby is a gift to Lakshman and I after many losses that we've suffered in silence. But when this baby happened, we didn't even realize. And the funny story is that we only found out because I had a pregnancy kit that was expiring. An expensive one that I had for many years and I didn't want to use it at all. And I just didn't want to throw it out and I tested it and we found out we were pregnant. And it was like, a lot of people say that this baby is a quarantine baby. It's because I was working from home. I was well rested. It's not, it's not any of those at all. This baby happened according to God's perfect plan and God's perfect time. More than just a miracle, this baby is God's promise to us. He first promised mommy. When she told me about it when I was getting married, I was like, yeah, right, whatever. <laughs> and then God spoke to me in August of 2015. Not only did he say about the baby, but he told me that it was going to be a boy. But I never spoke about it to anyone at all and I just kept quiet. And on top of that, he's spoken to me many, many times as well in the last five years. And he's also given that same verses to Lakshman. He's also promised to Lakshman. And God had always been with us, regardless of what people said. We have a lot of people around us who are really caring and concerned. Family, friends, everyone. So a lot of people are like, are you trying for a baby or not? Some people were very subtle. Some people were very open. Um, a lot of things. People are like, well, I'm praying for your health. I'm praying for your family. Have you seen a doctor? Have you done this? Have you taken this medication? Have you done this? Have you done that? Every time I did something, nothing happened. And then finally I was like, God, you promised, you take care, and I just gave it to him. And then it happens according to God's perfect timing. And even when God said a few things about the timing, I was like, I don't know. Let it, let it just happen whenever it happens. And you know, sometimes doubt creeps in when you are, um, when you're waiting for such a long time and so many people are talking and pressurizing about it. Doubt creeps in, but every time that does happen, God still promised. He still fulfilled His promises. And for us, I feel like it's not just a regular miracle. It's not just my plans. I am an OCD person. I plan everything so much. Even for Christmas, I did all of my Christmas shopping in October, not knowing whether we will come or not. And I finished my packing two weeks ago, still not knowing whether we will come or not, you know? I'm that kind of a person, but two things in my life I never planned. One was my marriage and two was his baby. Because it's beyond our own control and I just left it to God. I completely surrendered to God and I said, it's up to you. You do what is right. And um, for someone like me, God is not just God. God is my father, you know. And I'm, I look up to God and I know that he will do um, what any earthly father will do and way more than that. And God has clearly clearly done way more than that and this is not just the first miracle this is one of many miracles that god has done in my life personally in Lakshman's life personally but i think i feel like this one miracle has surpassed everything else in the past that nothing else that can happen in the future will ever cause anyone doubt to me even if god gives me a promise and it doesn't happen immediately i know it will happen because god has promised and he is a God who fulfills his promises because he doesn't lie. So I just want to really thank God, actually, because um, if I don't, I, it is only God who deserves all the glory at this time. If I don't give that glory to him, then it's not even right um, for us to be, to be here. So, yeah.